Have you accidentally deleted your photos and important files from your iPhone and you realize you need them back? Maybe you have tried different ways to retrieve it, but you haven't been successful. Then you're in the right place. Because in this video, I'll show you a quick and straightforward method to recover those permanently deleted files and get them right back to your phone. All you need is your iPhone and a Mac. So without any further ado, let's get started. When you delete photos or files from your iPhone, they are initially moved to a recent folder. This folder keeps them for 30 days, allowing you to recover them easily. However, after 30 days, they are gone forever. But don't worry, we've got your back. We can recover those photos and files in just four steps. The first step is to download and install DiskDrill on your Mac. DiskDrill is an amazing tool designed to recover lost and damaged data from a wide range of devices. Whether you're using an iPhone, Android device, hard drive, or a memory card, this drill has got you covered. To begin with, click the link below this video and it'll take you to this page. From here, download the free version of Disk Drill. And once that is downloaded, let's install the software. To do that, first take the downloaded file and drag it straight to your applications folder and click install. Now, Disk Drill will ask you for permission to grant full disk access. But don't worry, here's what you need to do. Just click on security and privacy settings and look for Disk Drill in the list. And make sure you enable it. Now click on quit and reopen. Then click OK. Now it will ask you for the admin username and password. Just enter that and click OK. Here's the final stretch. Just drag this icon to the app list to complete the process. So now we have successfully installed the software on our computer. So let's go to the next step, which is to connect your iPhone with Mac. So to do that, just take your connector cable, connect the iPhone and the Mac. Okay. So head over to iPhone and iPads here. And here you will find the iPhone unpad. So now it's time to pair the iPhone with your Mac. So just click here and you will receive a notification on your phone. Just tap trust and enter your phone's password. All right, now you can disconnect and reconnect your iPhone to the Mac. And once you successfully connected your iPhone with the Mac, it will appear on the screen like this. Now let's move on to the third step, which is recovering the lost data. To do that, simply click on the device, click search for lost data. Now the scanning process will start. But hey, before we begin, make sure you've got enough space on the system Otherwise, the scan won't work. If you need more space, this drill will ask you to choose another storage. But wait, it needs your mobile password to continue. So just give an input. And once the scan is completed, all your lost data from your iPhone will be displayed right here, neatly organized in folders. If you open the contacts folder, you will see all the deleted contacts from your iPhone. Take your time, explore and browse through them. Let's say you want to recover a specific photo. Simply select it and click on recover. Now choose the folder where you want to restore this file and click next. As you can see, we need to update the digital software in order to recover these files. In the free version, you can only view the files that can be recovered. But to recover them, we got a level up. So let's move to the final step, which is to upgrade the digital software. To upgrade the software, just click the link below this video and it will take you to the upgrade page. Here select the plan that you want that suits you the best. This drill has a fantastic offer. If you buy the software for Mac, you will get the Windows version for free. So simply choose the plan you want. I am going to go with the Pro plan. Now fill in your details and click continue. Here enter your payment details and click pay now. Once you have made the payment, you will receive an activation code in your email. So just click here and paste the activation code that you received. Click activate and that's it. You have successfully purchased and activated the pro version of Disk Drill. Now you can fully recover your permanently deleted photos and files. So just click here, then click recover and the selected files will be recovered in seconds. To view the recovered files, click here and you can see the files right here. Open them up and you can make sure everything is as it is. And that's how you recover deleted files from your iPhone using Disk Drill. Now that you know how to recover individual files from your iPhone, 
let me show you a time saving technique to recover group of files all at once. To do that, click here to go back and go to all files. Let's say you want to recover all your photos. Simply select that folder and click recover. Now choose where you want to store the photos, then click next and watch all your photos getting recovered in one go. So let's open the folder and you can see that all the photos have been recovered from your iPhone. So there you have it guys, that's how you can recover permanently deleted files from your iPhone. Now if you want to know how to recover deleted files from a Windows PC, you can watch this video. Okay guys, I hope you found this video very useful and if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to Website Learners. And thanks for watching, I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care, bye bye.